Mr. Schmidt. This is a little chemistry demo about the natural indicators that's found in cabbage and other uh, fruits and vegetables. So what the recipe calls for, you're working off of a Scientific American uh, posting. What the recipe calls for is to shred a cabbage, add hot water, and then test it with different household ingredients to see uh, how pHs affect the color of cabbage. So step one, cut up the cabbage. Okay, the call for about two cups of cabbage, or at least half the cabbage itself. Okay, what we're trying to do is get all the colors or the uh, molecule that contains the color compound um, in solution and out of the cells. So what we're going to do is we chop this fine, and then next up, we're going to dice this up. Okay, so we've let this set 10 minutes. I also uh, use the blender to uh, chop it up a little bit more. It's also gonna make it easier to pour. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to filter this a little bit and pour it into each of the glasses. I'll then add five milliliters of each solution to see, or uh, solid to see what the pH or the color indicator is from all of these. Okay, so if we open this up, we can start pouring these into each glass. Ooh, smells like cabbage. All right, and you can see the water is really taking on the color of the cabbage especially if we put it under a white background here. Okay, so now the fluid is very purple. All the different colors. Hopefully they don't look purple. All the reason the same amount. Their pH should be close to seven up right now. So now the question is, what happens when I start adding different solutions here? So I'm adding five milliliters. First one, cream of tartar. It is um, used in some baking to stabilize egg solutions. Finally, which, like 
said, whenever you're working with cleaning products, never mix them together. Now what we see, a solution that start out looking like that has now taken on some very different colors. All right, so we gave it a little time and we sorted them all out by pH. The bar uh, cleaner did take on more pH. We added a little more solution to it um, because the label said acidic. Um, this is the most acidic to the most basic here by colors. Okay, and with that, thank you for coming.